the red hot hot heights district of tampa stone's throw serves a short menu of simple fresh seafood and innovative spirits Ooh, i love that lauren mooser and darius poindexter are here with all the delicious details thank you guys for joining us oh, of course hey, good thank morning. You for us. so good morning. Uh, tell us a little bit about uh, stone's throw so a little about Stone's Throw, um, we're a highbrow uh, oyster cocktail bar. Okay. So we uh, rely on fresh spirits, uh, fresh cocktails, and um, also fresh catch of seafood, uh, oysters, uh, fishes, uh, shrimp as well. Uh, we like to call our Stone's Throw away, um, so we're not that far from the um, other surrounding um, locations, um, like Steelbock, Armature Works, stuff like that. It's really right next to us. Um, so we like to base on um, vodka, I've got vodka, agaves, and gin spirits. Um, clear, and we have a Pick Your Poison program, which is basically Pick Your Adventure. Um, we have three set um, cocktails that you can just basically pick your gin, your vodka, your tequila, or your um, bourbon, and have a fun ride with that. Wow, sounds Ooh. good. Ooh, All right. That's a lot, I love it. <laughs> So what kind of uh, cocktails do we have here in front of us? Okay, so uh, the two over here, this one is Z Crazy Eyes. So over here, um, it's basil. Crazy Eyes? Is that mean, like the goal is to so, get crazy eyes at the end? Uh, that's the whole point. We like right. to shoot for Just to relax forward, a little bit. Lie on that. Um, it plays on a good um, spicy margarita, I like to call it. Um, it does have cucumber water, agave, lime, and a spicy shrub that we make in-house. So we just marinate a couple peppers for about two weeks, and we dump that right in there. Like I said, you pick your poison, so I will be using tequila, and that one, that gives the whole margarita feel in that one. Uh, the Jaguar Shark is another cocktail. Uh, very refreshing as well, very light to have out in the sun. Um, it reminds me of a Moscow Mule, if you guys are familiar with that, topped with ginger beer, um, lemon juice, and a Cotamaro um, liqueur as well, which I is um, the citrus. Fresh details and too. I mean, the big fruit, the, the colorful, yes. um, you know, accoutrements that, that come on top of this. It's just so beautiful and wonderful oh, yeah, to look definitely. at. You know what, Lauren? You know what he did, though? He put the drinks way on the <laughs> other side of us. <laughs> did he do that on purpose? Uh-huh. Uh -huh. <laughs> so, I mean, I do plan on making two okay. more to be on this side. We'll keep yeah. we'll Of keep course. Ya. No, of course. <laughs> well, go ahead and start No, oh, definitely, up. definitely. So um, we're doing the Z Crazy Eyes first. A couple basils in there. And we're going to start with some agave. You know, while you're mixing that up, actually, Lauren, when I was reading the intro there, I said the Red Hot Heights District. It may be a tongue twister for me, <laughs> but it really is true these days. Yes, we're growing, um, and we're super excited about all this growth. Um, with the extension of um, Stone's Throw, um, Urban Kai is um, an outdoor water activity rental company that's also coming on the tail end of Stone's Throw. So they'll be opening um, early next week. Um, and we you're also doing a great tease for our show, because they may, <laughs> may or may not be here as well. Oh, yeah, they're going to come and talk to you all about what they have going on and um, all the rentals that you can experience um, over in the Heights. Um, there's an extension of the Riverwalk all the way to Boulevard Bridge that we're really, really looking forward to um, and a 90-foot pier. So it will just expand our entertainment footprint in the Heights for larger outdoor concerts, larger yoga on the lawns, um, and different ways that people can interact and enjoy Tampa's community. Wow. Okay. How's the drinks coming? Oh, they're almost done. I see them a quick shake and we're done. See, I still right. think I would need like the pick your poison. Could I still do the pick your poison kind of program but need help? I, cause I'll be honest with you. I'm like, I don't know. Like, oh, yes. As I talk, oh, I like it. Yeah, we're all like getting <laughs> Oh, so they're really known for the cocktails here too. I mean, the view from Stone's Throw is incredible. You yeah. really, you cannot get closer to the water from the, the from the, the the benches, the bar at Stone's Throw. It's it's truly incredible. I hope you guys come check it out. Well, Zach, are you okay if Ooh. I take take? Oh, this by one? all means, are you okay? this is all this Natalie. Is one, this is, is the one that Natalie <laughs> wanted to try. She's had her hands all over it, so let's do it. I'm all in. I like the spiciness that's mm -hmm. happening in drinks these days. Now, my heart burn a different story, but we won't talk about that. <laughs> Mm. All right, now we also Ooh, got a some food over here as well that we uh, that you guys have prepared. Ooh, that's good. Thank you so much. <laughs> yeah, what are we making over here? Because I was going to say, I see a plastic baggie, but I, I don't, I'm assuming there's got to be more to uh, it. There, yeah. Of course there is. <laughs> I mean, so, I'm, not, I'm not a big uh, cook. But. <laughs> this is our uh, Singapore shrimp. It's one of our fun appetizers, very interacting, um, mm -hmm. hands-on. So it comes in a bag like this with a... Uh, Lime grass, ginger, sambal sauce. So you actually get the plastic bag at the Correct. table. Correct. Huh. So it's a super casual, you know, um, appetizer that's kind of fun and interactive and tastes amazing. So give it a pinch, give it a quick spin, and shake. So you'd be a bartender for a second, but just with food. That's all. <laughs> there you have it. I just see a disaster written all over. Like, I can see Natalie <laughs> wearing white enough. It goes like, yeah, yeah. yeah. I would be like in a white dress <laughs> and uh, be wearing Covered it. Covered in the sauce. That's really cool, though. I've never seen a concept like that. That's really cool. 
It's a, it's a good way to get people to interact, especially at the table. Anyway, exactly, yeah. exactly. Okay, so a stone's throw where it's at this. I swear, it feels like it's not even been a few years now, and no. the place is just <laughs> so exciting. It's blowing up. So exciting. Well, again, thank you so much for joining us. There was the information we just put on your screen. Zach, I feel terrible that you don't have a drink to cheers. Hey, do one, one of those. Do one of those. There we go. All four of us. Let's do it. Cheers. Cheers, cheers to a stone's throw. Thanks for coming.